Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is a very exciting video because I have got my Beautylish Lucky Bag. Although I don't like to call it a Lucky Bag when it's a Lucky Box. So I thought I'd do an unboxing on here just to prove that I haven't opened it. You can still see that it's sealed. So we're both, well, we're both. We're all going to be surprised together. So I've got my scissors so I can open it because they've done it with that tape that has string in it. So let us open it oh. oh wow this is my first year getting it yes last year's was amazing that's why i wanted it although i didn't know there were two types this was 75 dollars plus shipping and customs so I think all told I paid like £98 altogether with shipping and customs and I didn't know they do a $150 one so maybe next year I'll save up for that one but yeah it's really really pretty packaging it's uh, got loads of like palm trees on and owls and I don't know if you can see um, all that but yeah really really pretty and you do get a little tag which is so cute and it says, Lucky Bags are a Japanese New Year tradition that inspired us to create our own. The owl on this year's Lucky Bag is said to bring luck and good fortune in Japanese culture. We hope the surprises inside fill your New Year with luck, happiness and beauty. So, and it just says, uh, hashtag Lucky Bag 2017 and hashtag Beautylish. So, that's really, really cute. So, let's get into the unboxing. Oh! just want to say a little something before I start. My brother's autistic and he's making lots of noises in the front room so if you do hear it in the background that's just what that is, we're not touching anyone. Um, so everything is actually, it's got loads of black tissue paper, let's get rid of that first. Right, everything is wrapped up in, in uh, black tissue paper so I'm just going to grab it willy nilly and hope for it. I think from what I remember reading because it was um, way before Christmas that I pre-ordered this, I think you get seven items. Um, but we shall see. <laughs> so the first thing I see is um, a clean, is it a pocket? My apologies about that, my battery went. So the first thing you get is a clean, I'm going to butcher this word, but a pocketry, a pocketry, a pocketry. I don't know how you pronounce it, but that's what the word is. I'll show you. And it's a brush shampoo. And it's um, rose, I'm gathering it's a rose one because it's got a rose on the front. Just smells very fresh. Don't have like a, there's a slight hint of floral but it doesn't have that. So yes, yeah, so that's a, um, a brush cleaner, which I have a lot of brushes so I need a lot of brush cleaner. And this made me laugh but they give you a bottle or a, like a tub of the um, RCMA no colour powder that's really popular. <laughs> I've just bought some of these from Love, some of this from Love Makeup but you can never have enough of it so that's a really uh, a cool thing um, to get. Diving in again. Oh this is like bubble wrapped. Oh you get a Oh my god, I've got a Wayne Goss um, eyeshadow brush. Well, I imagine it's eyeshadow. It looks like a, um, a detailer brush. It's the number six brush by Wayne Goss. They're like really, really expensive. So I'm like so chuffed with that. And, oh my god, that is luxury for your eyeballs. That is so soft. And it looks like it's like really good for detail work there. So really chuffed with that. Oh my god! You get a um, Natasha Denona palette. It's a a times five palette, I think it is. I've got one of these, and it cost me forty quid for that. So straight away, um, well, I think that cost me a tenner from Love Makeup. I don't know how much that'd be, but that's forty. So that's fifty there, and then how much of the Wayne Goss brush is like twenty pound each. So it's the Natasha Denona five palette, and it's in number two. Oh, that's really nice oh oh look at that purple i don't know if it'll focus but look at that purple there that is gorgeous um yeah really excited about that so natasha denona and um, diving in right again oh i've got another one that's um bubble wrap You get, oh, an It Cosmetics Universal Brow Pencil. Awesome. Oh, Universal Taupe. 
so it should be alright. I've been wanting to try these because everyone goes on about the IT Cosmetic ones. So, um, so it's just your typical brow pencil, you've got your pencil bit there and your spooler bit at the end. Really uh, dig the packaging, really sleek. So that is so cool. And you also get a, oh my god, you get the Becca Afterglow palette. That is awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad I didn't buy this now. So, let's see if I can get into it. Oh my god, this is the £75 one, uh, the $75 one. I wonder what the 151 is. So, yeah, it's the Becca Afterglow palette, and it's in like a really um, lovely pink metallic case. And oh wow, it's eyeshadows, I think, though, isn't it? Oh no, wait. It, oh, it's um, you've got Moonstone Shimmering Skin Perfector, Rose Gold uh, Skin Perfector, Topaz um, Skin Perfector, you've got a Mineral Blush in Wild Honey, and you've got a uh, Flower Child Mineral Brush. They are the size, if I can show you that, I don't know if it's going to focus. They are the size of an eyeshadow pan, like if you've got one from like a Makeup Geek pan, that's the size they are. I don't know what's. They've got 1.4 grams, I'm not sure how big an eyeshadow pan is, but yeah, that's the that's the, the size, but that is really, really cool. I'm so chuffed with that. Um, I think I have got Moonstone. Um, I haven't got the rest of them, I think I've got Moonstone, but you can never have enough highlighters anyway, are you? So I'm really chuffed with that. Um, diving in again. Ooh. Oh. No, we're not diving in again. So that's everything that I got in it. So basically, basically, so you got the um, Becca Afterglow palette, which is blush and highlighters. You got the Natasha Denona Times Five palette in number two. I got a brow uh, pencil from It Cosmetics. You got a brush cleaner, like brush soap. Um, the RCMA No Colour Powder and a Wayne Goss eyeshadow brush. I would like to see what the XL packet got, but I didn't know they had it until I'd already pre-ordered it, and there was no point changing it then. So I'm actually really chuffed with that. It's, um, I think it's a cracking uh, box. I hope you've enjoyed this unboxing with me. I'm really excited about the box. If you do want to check out this box, it is once a year in the new year. Obviously, it's a new year lucky box. Um, the best thing to do is near towards like December time is to like message Beautylish they're really good at getting back to you and just say you want to go on the um, notification list and then you'll get an email you can then pre-order it and then it'll arrive in January that is basically what I did so that's the best thing that I can uh, the best advice I can offer you because it is just once a year and I do think if you I mean especially with it being once a year you can save up for it but I do think you are getting like a really good deal on that so it gives you a chance to try some high-end products and things that you might not necessarily um, try yourself so it is definitely worth it I must admit I am well impressed with the Wayne Goss brush if I could tell you how soft this is have you ever if you've got a kitten, do you know when the tail like whacks in your face and it's really soft? It's like that. It's like a kitten's tail on your face. Oh my god, I'm not doing it on my face, I'm doing it on my fingers. So yeah, um, I'm awfully now anyway. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like what I got. Um, let me know if you want me to use the Natasha Denona palette in a look on my channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below somewhere. And um, I will see you on my next video. Bye guys.